everybody, and I just took some medicine. Actually, wait a minute. Okay, hello everybody again. I just took some medicine, and sorry about that. Cinder was trying to get up on the bed again. Well, and Pip too, but we are back with another Fallout Valley video. And as you all should know, wait. Um, we just found dog meat. Look at him. So cute. Um, whoa, oh yeah, I forgot about that. Damn. Die. Die. Watch dog meat get on those guys. Ah. Get him, dog meat. Oh, look at him. Look at that. Watch that. Ready, watch. Boom! It just explodes their head. Wait. I know there's a bunch of stuff in there. Uh huh. Uh. Just gotta get all these guys' stuff. There we go. Okay, I'm coming. Yeah, look, there's a ton of stuff in here. A ton. Including rat poisoning. Yay. What you got? Oh, yeah, stim packs. He mostly finds really helpful items like stim packs and stuff like that. Like ammo. Also, I figured out that you, if you press this, you can close that. If you don't really want, I want to leave it open. Oh, and turn that radio off. Definitely turn that radio off. Um, so yeah, there's stuff all around here. There's pre-war money in here that you can use for cloth. Austin Buggle. What do you know? Tin can. Wrench. Nothing in there. Cap stash. Yeah. Pretty much the only. The only thing. The only money that's really important in this game is the. Uh, the bottle caps, not the pre-war money. Well, it's important for cloth. If you really need cloth, then yeah, but it's only good for cloth, but bottle caps are the actual money of the game. Which, yes, it does sound weird, but it is. Where'd dog meat go? I forgot where he went. Dog meat! Down here, what are you looking at? Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. What? What is he looking at? Do you want this? I already know what that is. Oh, he wants, he probably wants me to do this. Yeah. Okay, I already know that. Okay, come on. Come on, let's go. Move here. Okay, let's go. Come on. Come on. What are you doing? Okay, let's keep going. There's another cooking station out here. You don't really need to make these stations because unless you like want it in a specific spot. But, uh, cause they're just all over the place. There's stuff. And yes, I'm not just gonna walk past this because this is important. Here is the mole rat cave. Ooh, wait a minute. If I pick that up, 
I think I might be almost overweight. Let's see. Uh, nope, we're only at half. About half. So, pick all of these. Like I said, you could store all that stuff in cabinets that you can find over at that house that I was talking about. So, then we go into the cave. Dun, 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 dun. Um, there is something that's kind of weird in here. Like, there's a lot of mole rats, that's for sure. Um, there's bran fungus, yeah. And if you go into here, when you first start getting attacked, you really want dog meat behind you because a uh, rabid mole rat will come up behind you, I think, in here, maybe? Maybe. I know there's guys in here. Like, yeah, like that guy over there. Oh, oh yeah, look at them all. And you don't want dog meat just to take all the damage because he will get down, like he'll go down and he won't be able to fight, but he just can't die. Like he'll stop fighting every once in a while if he takes too much damage. Then you either have to stim pack him or, um, or just wait a long time. Oh yes, the brain fungus is used for some like potion things and chemicals that you can use later on in the game. So you can get like different alcohols and stuff. There is a radiation poisoning room where you can get a fusion cell. Which is very important because you need it for a uh, power suit. I mean, power armor. Air bottle. Is that another one? Call a bottle. Okay. So, if you go into here, there's a guy that will pop up behind you, I'm pretty sure. Oh, oh, there's, I think that might have been him. I might have been, he might have been triggered early. I hope so, because he always gets ya. He always gets ya. There's a lot of junk in here that you can use for stuff. Oh, there is a teddy bear that you can get if you push him around. It's really hard to get. You can't get him most of the time. Yeah, as you can see, He's under that tire now. But you don't really need teddy bears. So, yeah. I would, I, I'll, I'll get them. Like throughout the series, there's gonna be a lot of them. I'll get them if I have, if I'm able to. Oh yeah, um, these are lock picks. You have to have bobby pins to be able to do it. And you have to twist it. You have to get it at the right spot. Oh, and don't make sure it doesn't shake like that, because then it'll break and just move it slightly. And then it'll. There we go. And then this has really good stuff like bottle caps, fragmentation mine. Ooh, ooh, I didn't get this. I have a, this is a rifle, a pipe bolt action rifle. And a raider chest piece, nice. 
So yeah, there's a lot of good stuff in there. And mm, I don't remember where the that one spot is that I was talking about. Um, I think it's back. Yeah, over here. Oh yeah, yeah. See it? radiation. You can see that power cell over there. Oh, I'm still getting it. Okay, so make sure you're only in there for a few seconds. Don't get any of the brain fungus in there unless you really want it, because it's just kind of a waste of health and stuff. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Power cell, yes. Okay, back up, back up. There is still more stuff in there, so let's go. Uh, no, I guess not. Okay, backing up. Okay. Didn't take too much, which is good. I'm going to end the episode soon. So I'm going to head back to town. Then we will go back. Come on. There we go. A little laggy coming out, but we are here. So I'm going to go home, and I'm going to put some of my stuff. Well, I'm going to end it, and then I'll do it in the next video. And your AP is like your action points, I think. And the more agility you have, or endurance, or something like that, one of the one of them, the more of one of them that you have, the more uh, action points you will get. And action points are like how fast you can run. Your vats, well not how fast you can run, but like how long you can run. That's why that's decreasing when I sprint. So, yeah. And I think there, sometimes there's stuff in here. Yeah, like there's a bunch of stuff that's in here al uh, already that you could take. Which is pretty cool. Uh, but yeah. Okay, I will see you guys. I'm going to make more videos of this, and I am pretty sure I'll make some more tonight, because I can't do it right now, because I have to go back over to my grandma's house to go into town to get Steve's medication, and by the way, Steve is my dog, he's a chihuahua, and he's getting very, very old, and it's really hard for him to even bark. Like, he can't bark or else he'll get hurt. Like, he's not supposed to bark because it'll hurt him. If he didn't. So, I'm going to end the episode right there. And I will see all you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.